Hi guys, welcome back to another video and today's video I want to talk to you guys about rose water and aloe vera juice which one do you prefer to use on your locks? Now in the beginning of my lock journey I used to use rose water to help moisturize my locks and at that time it really worked I found it penetrating my locks it was nice it was soft but as time has gone on I find that using the rose water has made my locks feel a bit crunchy now I don't know if this has happened to any of you guys if it has do drop a comment below and let me know which one you prefer whether it's rose water or aloe vera juice and everybody knows that my favorite thing to use is aloe vera juice this is the one that really moisturizes my locks leaves my locks nice and soft doesn't feel crunchy and it just feels so nourishing to use so my point is if you have a product if you've been using a product for a while and all of a sudden it seems to not be working anymore then simply stop using it I've, because of the big hype with rose water everybody loves rose water it's moisturizing it is it is moisturizing but there comes a time some there comes a time when a certain products when a certain product doesn't work anymore I don't know if it's the change um, if it's because I'm going through the change or I don't know but all of a sudden rose water is not working so I only use rose water for my skin as um, a toner and I just stick with the aloe vera juice full of nutrients it just works it really really works for my locks keeps my locks soft and moisturized and yeah so for those of you who don't know how you use rose water or aloe vera in your locks I'm really referring to those start a lot people who just started your locks and you're looking for something to moisturize your locks or for those who've had locks for a while and they're looking for something new maybe you don't even use rose water maybe you've never heard of rose water or aloe vera juice but i would advise you to just try try either try rose water there's a rose water try the rose water or aloe vera use aloe vera juice i use this one um lily of the desert you can purchase this from Amazon or I use either the Puality Rose Water. They've got an Instagram page you can order from them and they've got a website as well. I'll link them below. Um, or this uh, particular brand of Rose Water, which is also from Amazon. So, you get your spray bottle. You fill it up. I mean, I've just shown you this for the video's sake. And unfortunately, I've got my cap from this bottle stuck in the bottom. But I'm just going to show you how you will apply the solution to your locks. So to stop your locks from drying out. Now, I maybe spray my locks, maybe two to three times a week depending on the weather if it's really um, hot outside then I might spray it more often if it's colder then normally my locks are protected in the winter I wear a hat a lot of the times but it's important to moisturize your locks in the winter as well so get your spray bottle you fill it you can fill it halfway or just how I've got it here and then you get your particular oil. I'm using this brand of oil, but I will share this in another video, how it's working in my locks, if it's working at all. So, you fill your bottle with your solution. Then you put a couple of drops 
this particular oil has got a dropper Ooh, which I found oh gosh get my trousers which I found quite useful so I'll put like a couple of drops into my solution say about five drops of the this is a, a hoba oil or some people say jojoba but it's not it's a hoba a hoba oil so you put that in your spray bottle give it a couple of shakes mixed up a bit and then go ahead and spray your locks paying attention to the Oops. paying attention to the ends always like um, hydrating my locks it just feels so good especially when my locks are dry which they are this morning so just make sure it's fully not too saturated but how much I've used so once I've done I just kind of run my fingers through my locks and then I would do my edges with some castor oil just run it through there so yeah that's how I use oh it feels so nice that's how I would use the the spray bottle just makes your locks more pliable as well more you know swingy swingy so yeah so that's how I would use that solution with the um, rose water or in my case I'll use the aloe vera juice because this is what's working for me I love aloe vera juice and for now as long as it's working I'll stick to using it and I want to thank oh, oh, oh I don't think Lil Miss Lil Miss Freens she was the one who advised me to try aloe vera juice so I want to thank her thank you Lil Miss Freens follow her she's got a lock channel too um, she's got lovely locks so yeah so thank you for the for the tip see although we've got I've got a YouTube channel um, I also watch other lock wearers and we help each other you know they might have a product what's working for them they share it and then I may try it and then I share it and then whoever watches me will get the tips too so sharing is definitely caring so guys that's it for today as I said, I will come back and I'll let you know how this Ojoba oil is working for me. So far, so good. Because, you know, Ojoba is very good. It mimics um, our natural sebum in our hair or our skin. You can actually use this on skin. But I will go into that in another video. So, guys, thank you again for watching my video. Don't forget to subscribe subscribe and don't forget to click the notification bell so that you'll be alerted of my up and coming videos I've got good videos coming up guys so press that subscribe button help me to reach my goal which is uh, my first 1,000 subscribers I really will appreciate it so as always stay blessed stay beautiful Stay uniquely you. And I'll see you all 
in my next video. Thank you for watching. Mwah.